guys, Karen here with another La Crusade video. Welcome back to our channel and thank you so much for watching. Happy holidays! We are now down, officially down in the countdown towards Christmas. Um, and so I'm not going to keep you guys long today. Our home is slowly filling up with um, guests, well not guests, uh, adult children. <laughs> coming home for the holidays and so if you hear any noise in the back in the background that's them so we're supposed to go out today and do a little bit of shopping um, I don't know if anybody else is like me I enjoy not only I enjoy shopping but my favorite type of shopping is grocery shopping um, and that's because you can find so many different things um, to cook with and stuff like that like so we're all excited about that and um, yeah, and some of them want to go to particular stores so that they can get a whole lot of it and take it back to um, the states that they live in. So that's exciting. But anyway, um, welcome back if you're new here. Hi, I'm Karen, one half of a dynamic duo of Karen and Maya. And here we talk about all things La Crusade, gardening, um, all sorts of things. So if you are enjoying it, we would appreciate if you hit that like and subscribe button. And join the fam and for those who are returning hey guys thank you for coming back um, so today let's get into it I'm not gonna keep you guys long today I decided well this is like you know what I do each year so I release my wish list for next year so I was like let's keep that going um, because I did that this time last year and the year before that so we're gonna do that and what I would love it for all of us to do, if you are preparing a wish list for next year, let us know in the comments below what things are going to be on your list for 2024. As you well know, if you've been here for a while and watched any of our videos, you know I have a lot of pieces already. So this wish list is not going to be long, believe me. And as you can see, if you were uh, really looking at the thumbnail, you'll notice one thing on my wish list. Um, that is well beyond my control <laughs> is um, the release of bamboo in this in the US yes that's on my wish list um, I am so hoping that um, the color bamboo gets released this year hopefully for the spring wouldn't that be lovely the uh, spring this you know releasing the color bamboo in spring that would just be so nice so, I'm putting it on my wish list. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm putting it on my wish list and hopefully it will happen. We shall see. And if it happens, I have a few things that I would like to get in that color. And then there are a few things that I would like to get regardless if that's the color or not. So, but I am thinking next year there might be a green for us here in the U.S. Hopefully, another green. Mm, yeah, they just gave us time. I don't know, but that they released it at the end of the year. So here's to hoping, right? Okay, so first up, the, if 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 bamboo is released, I would like to get um, the two and a half quart brazier. I already have the three and a half quart and the five quart brazier um, in the color chambray artichoke, and then. Chambray, yeah, oh, chambray artichoke, and then, oh my goodness, I can't remember what the other one is. So there's two, two, this is terrible. Okay, I can't remember what the, I will go look and put that in here. Um, but we have two three and a half quart brazers, and then we have one, oh, cool mint, just remember. <laughs> I was trying to remember one of the videos. But um, so we have cool mint artichoke, and then the large one is um, chambray, the five quart. So I would love to add the two and a half quart um, brazier to that. And if the color bamboo is available, that would be great. But if not, um, then I'm open to probably sea salt before it's discontinued or um, oyster. Um, next, I'm looking, I have my handy dandy laptop. Um, the other thing that's on my wish list this year is the pumpkin coquette. 
someone, one of you guys, um, gave me a really good idea. Um, instead of purchasing the pumpkin coquette in a pumpkin color, like in an orange color, um, if I put... Uh, got it in a different color let's say sea salt it would you know I would probably find more things to use it for because then um, you know aesthetically it doesn't appear I mean it still appears as a pumpkin but then there you know then but I'm not you know in my mind I'm not saying like oh this is a pumpkin therefore it should be used at this time of the year because I do that I don't know if anybody else does that but that's how I think like I'm like I put things into categories, kind of, you know, sort of, and then that one, that was, that's when it'll be used. That's just how, you know, um, when, with things like that. Um, if it's shape of a Christmas tree, it tends to get filed right there in the winter category <laughs> in my mind. I don't know if anybody else is like that, but I was looking at the pumpkin coquette in the color sea salt. Anybody else like me? I'm sure I'm not the only person. I know I'm not the only person. The other thing that I was thinking of is the oval Dutch oven in six and six and three fourths quarts. Nothing higher for me other than seven and a half, but they don't have that in the oval Dutch oven. It's nine after that. I don't need that much space. I don't, you know, and I don't have that much storage space for that. Um, but I'm like, well, you know, in order for me to see how the oval Dutch oven works, it's probably good to get that, but I would prefer to get everything on sale. If you've been following us for a while, you know, we love a good sale over here. So, um, most of the time I tend to follow the sales. So if it's not on sale, I tend to kind of, mm, you know, wait on it just a little bit. Um, but the oval Dutch ovens on my list. I would prefer to get it in the color bamboo But if the but then if not I haven't gotten anything in no I have one thing in oyster, but um, I would like to get it in oyster or sea salt because those those two I think they're really beautiful neutral colors and they kind of pair well with anything um you know, let me know what you think in the com comments below. Also, if you have the oval Dutch oven, please let me know what you think about that. So next up on the list, surprise, surprise, is the Signature Chef's Oven. Great, great pot. When I said that I really like this pot, I was not joking. I think it's a wonderful piece to have. It's seven and a half quarts. Um, so many colors available and it's still on sale for 300 dollars well $299.99 but its original price is $462 so I was thinking you know if they release it in the color bamboo definitely um you know even over the oval dutch oven I you know definitely and then but if not I like it I would like to get it in the color olive um that I think that's a very beautiful color um, and one obviously that I don't have already, but that's on my wish list as well. Did that surprise you? Let me know if that surprised you. And then um, another one that will likely surprise, this is back, it's on my wish list, but it's another signature saucepan. Yes, you've heard it here, guys. That would make three. And the reason being is because it is such, it is so handy and so useful. Um, and yeah, and I don't want to wear the other two out, so that would alleviate some of the useful uses that I use the other two for. But I really, the sauce, the signature saucepan, the um, two and one fourth quart is on sale right now for $179.99. Its normal price is $268. So I'm not sure, you know, we're all aware of in the new year price increases coming. So if you are thinking about something or something's on your wish list for right now, 2023, and you can and you're able to go ahead and, and, and get that, I'm, I'm almost certain the price increase won't hit January 1st, but mm, last year, we the first price increase was in February. So yeah, because I went back and checked the videos. So the first price increase was around February. So yeah. So, but this the saucepan would definitely be on my list 
and it would be in another probably neutral kind of color because I have a lot of bright colors already but definitely that and I think that's it I don't really have anything um, I don't really have anything else that I was thinking about um, I did like the color Rowan so I was thinking maybe if the oval Dutch oven if not bamboo then maybe Rowan um, or oyster or sea salt but let me know what you guys think in the comments below and how are you guys enjoying the holiday time what are you all doing per to prepare these last couple of days do you count down what are you guys doing let me know in the comments below and um, yes and don't forget we're doing a giveaway um, so all you have to do is like this video uh, be subscribed to the channel channel and leave a comment below and um and that's it and then we will draw for that on tomorrow but we will see you guys in the next video thank you so much for watching bye guys